Hey, what's up guys, boys and girls, fellow collectors from all around the world. Ivan Seb, the French collector is back for yet another video, guys. A really stressful video, actually, guys. Um, I have a situation here. Today's, um, I don't know when this will be online, but as I'm filming this, today is December 24th. Just about two hours ago, I was getting ready for tonight for Christmas Eve, you know? All of a sudden, FedEx guy uh, rings at my door and brings me this huge box. I'm like, oh my God, this is um, the um, Hasbro life-size uh, Proton Pack from Ghostbusters Afterlife. A life-size proton pack is something that I've been dreaming for ever since I was a kid, right? I ordered this one a year ago. I can't wait another day to, un to unbox it. I have to check it out now. The problem is that the dining room, the living room, where I usually uh, film my videos, right? You know, you have space there, you know, nice coffee table where I can put my stuff. The light in this room is great. But now this room is already ready for uh, Christmas Eve later on right the table is ready so i can't film there also this box is huge and i, I really need a, a, a camera guy to help me but both my best friends are busy already with their families so it's just gonna be me alone here uh, on this uh, in my workshop in the garage but you know i can't wait so anyway let's check this out i'm gonna try to do my best right but i'm really excited so so here we have the Neutrona wand already uh, that I bought a year ago, maybe a year and a half, can't remember. Um, which will be needed in a few minutes. So I'm gonna put it aside for a moment. You know what this place needs, guys? Uh, at least some kind of Christmas decoration. Uh, hold on, just give me a second. Yeah, much better, isn't it? So, damn, look at the size of this thing, it's huge. Anyway, get my swiss army knife and let's start holy shit so it's a shipper box in another shipper box that's crazy so it says please open from bottom this thing is extremely heavy jeez oh my god look at this so before i proceed let me just show you the artwork of this box absolutely amazing they really went to town we have this thumb print here well it ain't working so what's in the back egon spangler proton pack whoa 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 so here we have the instructions in this envelope. We'll check it out later. Well, look at this box, damn it. I guess this slides kind of like in the movie. Oh, okay. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? <laughs> okay now this is obviously supposed to be i guess um molten marshmallow but <laughs> it looks like fuck i can't do this it's christmas after all i'm not gonna say it guys but um <clears throat> yeah it just doesn't look like uh, molten marshmallow okay that's awkward let's put it aside okay we don't need this for the moment then we have this small little ghost trap kind of box. Gotta open it. Dude! <laughs> oh shit! They look fantastic! I completely forgot these would be uh, included in there. So we have three um, mini puffs that are burned to a crisp with uh, three additional heads they look adorable i love them already bought a couple of these um a year ago so now i have the burned versions <laughs> those are so cool man i'm gonna i'm gonna add one in my um 
I guess actually I could even add a couple. I'm gonna add a couple uh, in my wreath. Maybe a, a, a clean one and a burnt one. They look so cool. OMG, I love them. But anyway, let's keep, I mean, look at this guys. <laughs> look at this mess. Damn it. I really love the sliding uh, wooden floor here, the sliding part, just like in Afterlife, when she uh, slides this piece of the wooden floor and it reveals uh, Egon's uh, ghost trap that he that was hidden in there. Anyway, I guess that's all. Okay, I'm, I'm really, really excited now. I'm discovering this live at the same time as you guys right now watching this video. It looks huge. Whoa, that is, oh my God, that is fantastic. Jesus Christ, this looks beautiful. Damn it. Look at, damn, it's beautiful. Look at the detail, the weathering. Obviously this is the Afterlife Proton Pack. So it's Egon Spangler's Proton Pack, but 30 years later, completely weathered and with a few mods. That is so cool. I'm gonna try to take it out of the box now, hold on. Oh, there's still more stuff in there, jeez. So this is the stand, storage stand. My God. Yo, this is really, really cool. It comes with these stickers. So on the pack, we have these weathered stickers, but in case you want to mod it to a Ghostbusters 1 version, you have the clean stickers. This is amazing. And we have Egon Spengler's journal. Wow, this is so cool. I'll check this out a bit later. And we have those vintage stickers. So we have, we have Afterlife stickers and also stickers from the part one, Ghostbusters, Don't Cross the Streams. Damn, and, and they're really nice. Okay, so here it shows how to assemble it. So I'm gonna give it a try. Doesn't seem too complicated. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, assembling this, putting this together was a bit of a bitch. It's not complicated, but you really have to push really strong. I was afraid I would break something, but anyway, so... Also, let me tell you that once this is assembled, there is no way you can disassemble it. So here it is. It sits on the stand, but I don't know how well it's secured. I guess it's okay. Oh my God, this thing is beautiful. It's absolutely fantastic. Jesus Christ, look at the weathering. So let's see if we can open this, open this just like in Afterlife. because I don't have those batteries. I checked everywhere in the house and I don't have those batteries. So tomorrow's Christmas. I have no clue when I'm gonna go and buy them. Damn it. I'm, shit. Well, I feel like a rookie now. I, I, I haven't used these batteries in years. I haven't bought them in years. I didn't need them. But okay, whatever. But then what a beautiful piece. Okay, well, let's put this back in the box. Oh my God. <sighs> Shit. Put this back in the box and um, I'm disappointed now. Damn it. Guys, I just found them. I cannot remember the last time I bought these batteries. I think the last toy I had that required them was when I was a kid, my TMNT pizza thrower. So 
long time ago, right? Um, you know, I don't like doing um, two-part videos, you know, several videos about the same thing. But I think this time I'm going to make an exception and call it a day. Because look at the time I spent unboxing this Proton Pack and it's still not assembled. We still haven't seen it working. Um, there were tons of things to um, take out of this damn box. It was a huge box, big unboxing. So uh, I'll stop the video here. Big props to Hasbro for the packaging. I mean, this is really well protected. Two shipper box. I've never seen this. I'm going to make another video now assembling the Proton Pack showing you how it works hopefully everything works fine and we're gonna connect it to the neutrona one and uh yeah i'm really excited so for the moment that's it for the unboxing and uh to be continued thanks for watching guys stay tuned for the rest bye bye